hello everyone welcome back to our channel today we are diving into another exciting use of the vlookup function in excel most of us are familiar with how vlookup helps us find data in large tables but did you know there are some creative ways you can apply vlookup beyond the basics please don't forget to like and comment your opinion so that youtube can recommend this video to more audience without any further delay let's get started for this demo i have a table employee id first name last name and salary scenario 1 the basic in the first scenario i have employee id and salary using the employee id i need to get the salary this is very simple equals to v lookup the lookup value is the employee id comma the table array is employee id to the salary column select all the table press f4 to freeze the range comma 4 salary is being the fourth column so comma 4 comma 0 close the bracket hit enter we will get the salary now let me format into the dollar sign so we will get the salary for this employee 1713 $6,019. Scenario 2. We need to get the salary of Hazel IV. If you look at the table, this Hazel IV is split into two columns, first name and last name. Row number 13, we can see Hazel IV. To get the salary of this employee, we have to add another column which combines the first name and last name to get the full name. instead of adding a column to get the full name we can use the v lookup to get the salary of hazel iv let's see how the magic equals to v lookup the lookup value is a hazel iv comma here is the tick please pay close attention we have to use choose function choose open the curly brace comma 1 comma close the curly braces comma under value 1 we have to take the first name and space and the last name so this will combine the b column and c column and it gets one column that's called full name comma we need the second column salary now we have to close the choose function then we have to specify the column position to return here the first name and last name is already concatenated as one column and the second column is the salary so we need the salary 2 comma 0 close and hit enter we will get the salary of hazel iv 5065 dollars if you look at the row number 13 we can see the salary 5065 if i change this name to uh, laila piper we will get the salary 5125 which is exactly matching you may get the doubt in the full name the first name is laila and the second name is piper what if the last name is in the beginning and the first name after the last name the time simply we have to change the the position of concatenating first we have to start concatenation with c column space and then b column that's it it will get the value of the salary that's it i hope you have learned a creative technique on how to use v lookup in advanced level using the choose function within the v lookup thank you so much see you in the next video